The federal government has trained youth on how to write bankable plan to end unemployment. The training brought together 160 youth from 17 states who participated in intensive sessions focused on critical aspects of business planning, including market research, financial forecasting, and strategic planning. While speaking at the closing ceremony of the two-week program held at the National Youth Development Center, Odeomu Ocean State, the Minister of Youth Development, Jamila Ibrahim Bill, reiterated the commitment of the federal government to ensure that Nigerian youth are meaningfully engaged to contribute to economic growth. The minister, who was represented by Director of Enterprise Development and Promotion, Federal Youth Development, Odu Bengamomo, emphasized the importance of equipping young Nigerians with tools necessary to transform their business ideas into viable ventures in the competitive business environment. The minister urged them to stay connected and support one another. They should when they go back, they should train others. They should be a trained trainers. And if I to train their colleagues, talk their parents at home that are doing business, they can equally tell them how to detect food, how to generate business, how to keep records. The two week training on how to generate, design and write a bankable business plan for youth entrepreneurs from the southern parts of Nigeria was part of the federal government's ongoing efforts to address youth unemployment and foster entrepreneurship. Some of the participants who spoke with OSBC News described the training as an eye opener. And I have also learned many things when it comes to entrepreneurship. It is not only by starting a business, you have to have a smart aim and objective. I'm going out as a new person, as a person who is able to, able to uh, prioritize his needs and wants in life. Beyond the workshop, the Ministry of Youth Development promised to engage them in mentorship programs and access to funding opportunities. Oluchi Amuda, OSBC News.